I love seeing uh, guys way too aggressively hit on girls on the street. It's like, <laughs> um, it's fine. She laughed. It's a comedy show. Um, and that's why I like being back in New York too, because like I, I'm not the type of guy to like do that. Like I don't go up to girls I don't know and just start talking to them. I'm more the type of guy to like stare at a girl until she feels the need to button her shirt one more button. <laughs> and <laughs> oh, that's right, I have a mustache now. Um, which, by the way. <laughs> I realized something backstage, I was looking in the mirror. If you're gonna have a mustache, wear a fucking undershirt under your... I, why am I not wearing an undershirt? When you have both, you just look like a Turkish jewelry salesman. Like, I just look like, ah, come on, what do you wanna pay? What do you wanna pay? Ah, go, where are you going? Come on. If, I, if this is a salesman, if I do this, I'm the owner of a Turkish jewelry store. <laughs> If I do this, I'm the dad of the owner of a Turkish jewelry store. Where was I? I digress. This is going to be weird now to button up my shirt while I'm telling the rest of this story. Uh, yeah, yeah, so I don't, I'm not aggressive with girls, but I swear I saw this on the street. This girl was walking in front of me, and this guy approaches her who I could only describe as, like, probably owning every Fast and the Furious DVD. So he goes up, he goes up to her, and he's like, he's like, Damn, girl, what you doing? And she's like, excuse me? And before she can finish, he goes, shut the fuck up! And he walks away. <laughs> what? How you doing? Shut the fuck up! And this was like a Monday morning. What, did he like leave the house with the intention of doing that? And then I thought about it, I was like, you know what though, I think he did her a huge favor. Because I thought, I was like, what if he just instantly lives out what would happen if he dates people? Like, he just instantly plays it out. Like, it's going to be lust, confusion, anger, leaving. That's how it's all going to go down. Just saved you two years. Or maybe he has this, like, psychic ability to live out anything in his life instantly. Like, any situation he goes into. Like, hey, hey, how do I work at T-Mobile? And the guy's like, oh, here's an application. He's like, fuck you, I didn't steal no cell phones! And he walks out. He lives out. 